Today's moth spotlight is a beautiful species of Saturnidae silk moth from Africa. Just hatching captivity. Here we see a specimen of the Bunea alkino, also known as the cabbage tree emperor moth, which is one of the most common species of Saturnidae in Africa. It is found in uh, many parts of the mainland of Africa, mostly. And they can be very variable looking. This specimen here has a sort of unusual color because it's kind of orange, uh, orangish. Rusty orange brownish instead of uh, the normal dark color. And it has unusually, uh, an unusual amount of white scales. Now is it that strange? No, because like I said, these moths they vary a lot. So if you breed them, expect a lot of uh, color variability, really. And it's one that I have yet to breed, even though I've had um, many adults of them before. But pairing them is uh, not very straightforward. It can be difficult, also because. Um, the adults do not tend to hatch very synchronized. Sometimes you have a male and then a few months later a female and then a few months later a male. So it makes it hard to pair them. It's a problem in captivity. Either way I'm still gonna try because the larvae are spectacular and I think if I ever ever manage to pair them successfully I think then raising the caterpillars would be a piece of cake for me. Oh. Looks like she's off to her own thing. Now come back here, still needed for the video. Ah, look at that, it's a completely beautiful, amazing species. Also loving the, the red, red thorax here. Covered with hair. Keeps her warm, keeps her muscles warm. And she doesn't like to be in the spotlight. Oh no, 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 don't go there. No, no. <sighs> Sorry. She's up to my neck now. Well, I shouldn't bother her that much, so I'm gonna go put her back and end the video in one minute. Because if she's stressed out, she may just lay some eggs prematurely and... Yep. There you go. Yeah. So now I have a giant moth flying here somewhere through my room. Thanks for watching and until next video.